What up, good old YouTube? LP with another tutorial? I think so. Uh, I'm making this quick video by request. Uh, somebody asked me how did I get the CRT filter on uh, Ninja Turtles, Shredder's Revenge. So that's what I'm going to show real quick. It's real simple. I mean, once you got it down, it's pretty easy. But let's get into it. So I'm going to have the links in the description. This is a, a reshade. Um filter most of you guys should know what reshade is by now it's been out for a long time but yeah you're going to want to hit the down download button on the reshade link it's going to take you to the bottom of the page you want to get the latest version of reshade here i mean you can save it if you want but if you don't have the latest sometimes uh you know it won't auto update you have to get the latest anyway so i just hit open so See, I'm downloading a lot of shit in the background, but okay, so it's gonna want you to find the game. If you know where it is in your files, just hit browse. And I got a quick shortcut to where mine is, so <laughs> yeah, my PC has pretty much every game. Okay, so here it is. Got Ninja Turtles here. Hopefully doing this again doesn't mess mine up, but I'm gonna show you. I'm not going to go through the whole thing, but yeah, once you found it, you want to hit next. Now, this depends on the game. At first, I was thinking Shredder's Revenge might have been OpenGL, but actually it's uh, DirectX 11. So this is the one that you will need. Once you, once you uh, click that, you want to hit next. And it's going to install it. After that, keep everything where it is. You don't have to uncheck or check anything else and just, you know, continue until that's done. And then you're going to want to go into that same directory folder where your game is, and you're going to notice you have this right here now. This is, there is a few other new files in here, but this is all you care about, reshade shaders. Now, when you click this, this is where the extra shaders and textures that you uh, download from another website go. In our case, we're using CRT Royale. I use this all the time on RetroArch. If you use RetroArch, they have it on there as a shader. So, okay, on here, here it is, reshade shaders. You're gonna click that. Now, well, actually to download it, you have to actually download the whole zip. And then once you extract that zip, the only thing you're gonna need is these two folders, which you're gonna copy and paste in here. And uh, once you do that, it's safe to open the game. Oh, crap. I just realized I'm recording this in HDR. Hopefully it doesn't look all messed up. But. Okay, so you'll see this message at the top here. That means it worked. It said to hit the home button. So I want to let the game load up first. Now, like I said in my previous video, uh, the CRT filter doesn't show up as well on uh, recorded videos and screenshots so it's hard it might be hard to tell how it looks on uh this video here it it works though trust me i don't know if it's gonna show up thick lines like my last one but let's just get into it so this is no filter here now if you did it correctly you will have cr Roy at the bottom here so we're gonna click that okay so like I said, I don't know how it looks right now while I'm making this. Now, one thing that was off, well, no, this was on by default. I turned it off because with it on, it's a little blurry. I noticed I had to turn it off when I had when I used CRT Royale for um, Ocarina of Time PC port as well. So that's the only thing I really needed to change. Actually, I did mess with the gamma a little bit. This one right here is CRT Gamma and it's LTD Gamma. Just mess around with that a little bit or copy my settings. Um, yeah, that's really all it is to it. See, off, on, you wanna, oh. I set a effect toggle key so I can just like switch it off and on on the fly. I just made an insert key just to like try to see the difference. But yeah, that's all it is to it. If you got any questions, uh, you know, just shoot me a comment or something. Um, if it helps, feel free to subscribe.
and uh, hit the like button, if you will. All right, guys. That's all. Peace.